welcome dear student today we'll see about the diagram for the spermatogenesis okay so first we'll start with the primordial cell so this is a primordial cell which is a diploid make the circle inside from this we got the two primordial cells from one we got the two primordial cells so both are the diploid only from each again we get the two so here we got the total four which are the spermatogonia so which are the diploid now from this one of this we get the primary spermatocyte from here we get the primary spermatocyte which is the having the bigger size so we can say that this is a about the growth phase now from here the meiosis 1 which is taking place so from this diploid cell we get the two haploid cells so here we got the two haploid cells which are the secondary spermatocytes so here we got the two haploid secondary spermatocytes now it undergoes the meiosis 2 so from here we get four haploid spermatides from each we get the two are the haploid spermatides from this here we'll get the spermatozoa from each we'll get the spermatozoa so we'll make the shape like that so this is the head of the spermatozoa now this one is the neck region now we'll make the tail region we got the four haploid spermatozoa now we'll label the parts we'll make the arrow of this and then we'll label the parts so this is what about the spermatogenesis we have finished this diagram with the step by step okay which is a important diagram which may come for two or three marks okay or the description describe the spermatogenesis with the help of the diagram may come for the four mark okay so this everything we have completed after completing this you have to label all the parts step by step okay thank you if you like my channel subscribe and share with your friends thank you